welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be about setting up my bullet journal for 2021 and i have been really waiting a long time for setting this up also this is my first year of bullet journaling so i am really really excited let's see my supplies i am going to use a pencil a silver brush pen some liners glue and craft paper because my theme is going to be on craft paper i made i had made an instagram poll of if i should make um, my theme on black and white or craft paper and the most of the votes were on craft paper and i also had ideas for both of them so i'm starting with writing my name on the first page and this is the most satisfying thing and writing uh, your name on a fresh new bullet journal or a new notebook also i didn't add any separate key page because i was i was not i was thinking that i will not make my keys too much messy or hard to guess they will be really simple and easy i won't be complicating the keys and i have memorized the keys that i want to use in my journal for my for better for me to understand it okay for after writing my name i'm going to add craft paper at the bottom to write the name of the year okay so in the next page i'm going to write the um, year name um, in quite medium size letters and I will be adding some more things here and they will be my habits or the things I want to apply in 2021 you guys will see me using a lot of craft paper in this video because the theme is craft paper Also, I saw another benefit of using the craft paper that whenever you do a mistake, you have the option to just pull it up and cover it with another paper. So that was really, really useful and handy for me. And I kept doing a lot of mistakes and I kept just peeling them off and adding some more craft paper. Okay, so I'm starting with writing work hard. Then it is pray, then be positive, and be kind. Now I'm adding some wavy lines and lines to decorate it. Okay, on the next page, I'm going to add, do my grid spacing cheat sheet. My notebook is not a dotted one, so I'm using a ruler to write the line numbers in a correct line.
the next page is my quote page The quote says, may every day of the new year inspire you to grow. And I really enjoyed writing this um, quote. I just googled this quote about new years and I found this. My next page is going to be my future log or the year calendar. I'll be fitting all the 12 months in these two pages. Okay, now I'm using my phone to just write down the dates. Also, um, there is a little bit space after every month, beside every month, and there I'll be writing important day, import, um, marks for important occasions like birthdays or exams.
now i am again adding earrings the wavy lines and some dots and lines to decorate it also some stars and um small dots moving on the next page is going to me is going to my be my things to check out page i'll be just writing some things that i want to check out later or uh, in this year and just to write down them to memorize them or just not to forget them as this is my first bullet journal i am doing a lot of lettering mistakes or spelling mistakes but it is really it was really easy for me to just cover them because i was using craft paper as my theme and whenever there was i was doing a mistake i would peel a craft the craft paper off and add a new one or if it is a just blank page then i would add some craft paper on it to add details On my things to check out list there are the titles are for songs books spread ideas that i would like to try and art now i'm just bolding out the letters again lining them The next page is going to be my YouTube ideas. There are three separate columns for my YouTube ideas, and the columns, the each column con, um, headings are. Vlogs, art, or calligraphy, and. bullet journal whenever i will think i will come up with an idea i will just note it down or i will search for ideas and note it down so that when i want to make a video i just don't um get out of me uh, i just don't i the situation will be like i don't have any ideas yeah The next page is my budget tracker and I really really messed it up so I'm just cutting out a big um, big page of craft paper for um, adding on the page
I have just made five columns or rows. I think they are these are rows for um one is for phone bills, food and stationery others and the final one is total it is for how much i spend on each month The next page is my places I have traveled for keeping the list of the places I have traveled in 2021. The next page is for what happened in 2021 to keep a track of the things that happened are important or I think important for me to know what happened or the memories that were imported in 2021. So my setup for 2021 is complete and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Now I'm going to show you the final lookout. How it finally looks and I really like the setup. Do let me know what do you guys think of this setup. If you guys like this video make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel.